What's up guys, this is Dennis from SEO Bots, and in this video I'm going to show you how to scrape or extract hotel information from a list of hotels on booking.com. Before I continue, please like this video to support our channel and if you would like to see more bot tutorials in the future, go ahead and subscribe to our channel right now. Collecting hotel information from sites like booking.com into a single place and organizing your data can be a really tedious task, which is why we wrote a bot to help you out with that. So to start using our bot, first thing that you will need to do is sign up for SEO bots. I will leave a link in the description. Next you need to log in and click on this toolsforbooking.com link in the upper section of the website and find this booking.com hotel scraper bot. Click on that and now go ahead and read the documentation which explains in detail what the bot does. I'm just going to quickly show you what kind of data you will be getting when using this bot. As you can see, I provided a search query to the bot and it returned a bunch of hotels with their data points. For example, hotel URL, image URL, name of the hotel, stars, price for the selected period, type of the hotel, if it's a guest house, if it's a resort, if it's a regular hotel, address, number of reviews, popular facilities, and grades for different services. Now let's go ahead and try launching the bot ourselves. Click the start this bot right here. And now you'll see this form which you will need to fill out. First, you need to give your job a meaningful title. This is an optional step, so I'm going to skip it. Next, you need to select how many hotels you would like to scrape. I'll leave it at 10 because I'm doing this demo video and the more hotels you select, the more time it will take the bot to do the job. Finally, you will need to provide a listing URL to the hotel selection. Let me show you how to get one. Let's go on booking.com and let's look for hotels in Prague for this date range right here. So January 2021. You don't have to select the dates, but if you would like to get a price for the selected period in this column right here, you should definitely select your date range. Okay, let's click the search button. And now you can see that the search returned 500 something properties. You can filter them out by using checkboxes right here. So I'm going to click a bunch. I'm left with 52 properties and I'm going to copy this link and I'm going to paste it right in here. I will disable notifications and I will click the start this bot button. You can see that my job was created and is now in an active state. As you probably understand by now, what the bot will do, it will go onto this URL and it will go one by one collecting information from each and every one of those hotels from here into my spreadsheet. Don't forget to like this video while we're waiting and don't forget to subscribe to our channel because we post a lot of content about automation and productivity and uh, stuff like that. I fast forwarded the video and you can see that it took less than a minute to complete the job. Let's click the view data button and see what we have. You can see that we have 10 hotels in the spreadsheet indeed as promised and all of the necessary information returned. But this is practically it. Make sure to like this video to support the channel. Make sure to follow us and subscribe to the channel as well. And I'll see you in the next video.